Yeah, hey, what's going on, world? I hope everything is going successful for y'all today, right? Now, Nutritional Health Wednesdays. It get crazy. Bam! Look at thick navy beans. These good for the system. Bro. These cheap. Now, salute to the nation. You know what I'm saying? The NOI, the FOI. Oh, hold on. Put these beans aside. If you ain't never had no damn bean pie, you don't listen. It's life changing. You need to chase down one of them brothers with the suits on with the bow tie. Now, you're vegan. You got to make your own. So, gram for gram, eighth for eighth, ounce for ounce, pound for pound, right? Beans, right, in general, have more protein than the meats. Now, most people to be worried about just the protein, they usually don't give a damn about the minerals, the vitamins, polyphenols, right, phytochemicals, they don't give a damn about that. Just deal with the protein. You know, the protein starts killing the hell out of you, but it's going to be okay, right? Because it's a process, right, to get to greatness. In general, beans are a great source of potassium, right? Potassium is the heart mineral. Over 90% of damn people are not getting their daily recommended amount of potassium. The number one cause of damn death in the world, right, is heart disease, right? Damn, since I dropped, I dropped this video, one person done died from them heart disease, which high blood pressure is a form of, and then about three people done had a heart attack of a stroke. So anyway, so we're going to get back to these navy beans, right? These are going to be high, right, in the manganese, right? The good old folate, a.k.a. vitamin B9, right? And I told you about the potassium. We got some little thionine up in there, too. Listen, if you diabetic, right, you should be taking a plant-based form of vitamin B complex, right? So vitamin B complex in general, right? It helps convert, right? Them crazy old cars people be talking about, right? And them good old damn proteins and fats, right? To energy, right? So anyway, and if you diabetic status, all your vitamin B complex damn near just depleting in general. So, it's, but vitamin B one thionine is really gonna help, right, with your insulin levels, right, your blood sugar levels, right. So the manganese that's gonna be great for your nervous system, right. So with folate and people who have like MS, right, multiple sclerosis, right, uh, normally have a, a very high deficiency, right, of folate, um, not folic acid. That's like the old artificial uh, version that they may be making all in laboratories and stuff like that. So, also it's going to be great for your bone structure, right? And helping your body produce glutathione. Glutathione is your body's master antioxidant. You know, I've been talking about get the antioxidants from plants, but your body like, oh, these damn people are going to listen, so end up making this damn own or whatever. But the more antioxidants that you get in your system, right, the healthier you're going to be, right? The less antioxidants, right, or nutrients that you get in your damn body, the sick you're going to be. Where is the evidence at? Look how everybody eat. Look at the diseases, disorders, conditions, and illnesses, right? So anyway, if you if you get two to three cups of beans in, right, and you got some heart disease, right? Especially, I told you high blood pressure is a form of heart disease, right? You're gonna see all that get you gonna see a reversal. Th three damn cups, shall I say, right? Of beans every day. Get them in, baby. Navy beans. It's cheap. You know, these navy beans don't cost. You can get you a pound of navy bean for about a dollar, maybe less. Anyway, navy beans, these good for the system. 